Fortnite Chapter 4 Season 2 is right around the corner. That being said, the entire season has officially been leaked. So today, I'm talking about everything you need to expect in Fortnite Chapter 4 Season 2. Stick around because you do not want to miss a single thing that I say in this video. So, let's start off with for one of the major leaks. The entire Battle Pass lineup has been leaked. Two leakers, Sheena and Hypex, have leaked the entire Battle Pass. I'll put a picture on the screen right now what it looks like. So, the first skin in the top, we're gonna go from top left to bottom right, by the way, just to clarify. And this is not gonna be in order what the skins are. I don't know what how the skins are going to be like on the pages we don't know that yet so be aware that also the skins can also vary depending on what they look like because survey skins do look different to the skins in game so yeah they may change they may not change so yeah so the first skin in the top left is a lizard skin it is is something that we've seen already in the cyber quest next skin next to it is a bunny skin because obviously easter's coming soon so for the easter lovers you got a little bunny skin then next to that is probably going to be one of my favorite skins which is a brand new drift skin so yeah that's right they're finally continuing the drift i don't even know if the drift had a storyline but yeah they finally introduced a new skin for him there i'll be there's more information about this skin in a minute that i'll tell you about the skin beside that one is a kind of like a i don't know how to explain it. it's like a warrior with it, it has it has a lot of zero point colors to it so that will probably be a cool skin the skin below that is attack on titan because we're getting an attack on titan collab we are which is the secret skin more on that in a bit then next to that is just another no, another normal skin this one that one that one may look like it's customizable not so sure but it's well that's what it looks like to me the next to that is just an average girl skin it is which is obviously what we get in every battle pass an average male or girl skin and then next to that is uh i don't even know what to call that it's like a knight not a knight but not entirely sure what to call that but yeah that's the entire battle pass line up it is so let's so now more information about the drift skin so thanks to sheena we know more information about the new drift skin just so obviously we already know that this survey skin is the drift skin has a variant that looks a lot more like normal drift seems to have an unmasked style as well so yep yeah, we'll have an unmasked a mask star and a star that looks like the normal drift so any drift lovers you guys have got yourself a new skin now more about attack on titan so sheena and the hypex confirmed that it, i can't listen guys i've never watched attack on titan so i'm so sorry if i pronounce this name wrong evan jaeger is the secret skin of the chapter 4 season 2 battle pass which is 10 times better than what we got with gerald whatever this season don't question how i say that please so here's some information about his cosmetics so obviously the skin the emote will be scout regami salute Banner Icon Cross Swords, Pickaxe, Ice Fist of Titan, Animated Mew Emoji, Angry Evan, Weapon Wrap, 5 to 6 Hidden Page 2 items as well. So, yeah. And with the Attack on Titan collab, we're also going to be getting a new mythic, the Waste Grappler mythic for AOT. So, how this will work is that this will be very similar to the Spider Man mythic, it will where you swing not swing but like you know what i mean just go around the map it's like the what the grapple club is I, I don't know how much uses will have and i think it will have something else to it where you can attack also in mid air or something i'm not entirely sure how the mythic will work i haven't really got any information about that now that being said yeah we've already confirmed a lot of stuff the next season theme is futuristic theme it is so so similar to chapter one season nine we're going to be getting a lot of futuristic things so the first thing we need to talk about is that in the kid Leroy event we got these futuristic vehicles and these are actually the vehicles that we may get in season two they look pretty cool they do i kind of like how the back of it is no it's hot uh, to be honest i think a lot of people are going to hope they'll hover vehicles i'm not entirely sure if one is going to do that but we'll see if they do that anyways and while we're on the topic of futuristic actually no that doesn't make any sense so let's just talk about a small side note quickly 
there's also another club to expect. We're gonna get Fauna X Resident Evil, Leo, Leon Kennedy and Clara Redfield will be coming in the item shop. So if anyone's interested in that, I don't know if anyone I don't know who watches it, but if you guys are interested, look out in the item shop for these skins. Alright, next up is the PRI names. So every PRI, well not every PRI, but most of them have been leaked today. I have so season two leaks return of lucky landing new version so we are finally going to get a lucky landing 2 so for anyone that came into chapter 4 and they were like they didn't like the fact that there's no ogpys you're finally going to get one you are neon tokyo so we're going to get like kind of a futuristic neon boi we are new futuristic motorcycles so motorcycles are staying for next season as well as augments by the way we'll get more of that later new pistol and shotgun more on that later glowing mobility tubes that you can slide i don't know how that will work and obviously sheena and hypix gave the leak again they did so yep all right next up i'm doing this in order by the way of trying to put them together so yeah so i'm just oh yeah here are the py codenames as well for anyone that is interested cyber dragon dojo hot springs loot island neon city ac plus store zen garden for anyone that is interested in them i don't know if you will be interested in codenames but yeah some of you guys actually are so next up is that we are finally going to get a major thing in next season first person is officially coming next season via a hypex hypex g matrix games and sheena vr so yeah finally first person is coming next season now most likely this will be a toggle option it will now i'm not entirely sure how this will work i don't think they will do a separate game for i'm not entirely sure but yeah we'll see how this goes Ah, uh, next, so this next leak is a bit weird, it is, but I might as well mention it. So, Hypex tweeted that might be the most random leak I post, but the insider wants you to know that Little Whip gets splattered in the season 2 trailer. So, yeah, this, so my guess is, is that is, this insider, of course, works for Epic Games, and it's just leaking the entire season. This happened before. This is the second most leaked season since Chapter 4 Season 2, by the way, guys. So, yeah, just to let you know, yeah, PD's finally getting a break from getting destroyed in the trailers, but getting Little Whip in the strain now basically all right next up are not boring things but it's going to get a bit more well not boring actually no it is actually going to get boring i just noticed that we have we get another collab to talk about before we we'll go about that so before we get into the collab some uncommon scraptic upcoming slash scraptic exotic exotic i can't even speak exotics Balloon Sniper, Gas Sniper, Slurp, Projectile, Shotgun, Flare, Shotgun, Rift, Pistol, Gas Grenade Launcher, Firefall, Firefly Grenade Launcher, Big Run Grenade Launcher, so we don't know which one of these are scrapped or upcoming, we're not entirely sure, we do know that the Firefly Grenade Launcher was added to the files for Chapter 4, so we're not entirely sure if it was scrapped or not, the Rift Pistol sounds like the pistol that Jones used in the Chapter 2 end event, so I'm kind of disappointed we never got to see that, it would have been cool to be able to just shoot someone and and then to see them lift in the sky and you just be able to get away or something i don't know how that would have worked but yeah so now augments so augments are staying next season but they will be completely resetted that means i'm pretty sure your entire augment collection will go and i don't know if every single augment will be voted and they'll just bring out new ones i'm not entirely sure how it works but next season thanks to g matrix games and fire monkey we know that we will be able to we will be getting legendary augments so how you'll get these augments is that you'll get them from chess the three that are going to be on season launch are reboot respawn on death which is huge you'll basically be able to respawn death now, i'm not entirely sure if this will be in solo i don't think it will be it may be in something like a duo where if you get the augment your team it will just instantly spawn at the nearest reboot run I, if it's in solo then that's going to be mad like imagine two players left and then yeah the one doesn't die and so on next up is shield increase so this will make your shield increase from 100 to 150 or 200 shield last one is cypher siphon you will get 50 hp for every elimination so yep and also we recently we had the most wanted event next season there will be 
bunkers in each map that has a boss that you can defeat that will have key cards for allies and enemies so in other words then we could see vaults next season once again they're being activated for the entire season but this similar to chapter 2 season 2 and now the leaks get not weird but yeah yeah nope we're not going to do that so fire monkey posted that epic games is working on something called a big wheel grenade so it's big wheel attached wheel grenade so this might be something to do with cars the futuristic ones or it might be something that could that could destroy someone altogether we don't know what it is um subtract so for anyone that is interested here's some more code names i don't know if anyone will be interested in these i'm just putting them on screen just in case but it did show having these styles that are two styles two styles three styles two styles three styles three styles two styles there is a lot of variation of styles in this so anyone that's interested there you go and for attack on titan there are also conies as well so here you guys go for anyone that is interested in it i'm not going to read that out because it's not really that important now this is another then this is a major leak the loot island pori is set to be a sky island caused by the rift gate slash rift portal it's also referenced as a rift pori which might be able to teleport to via the rift gate so the rift gate might be able to teleport you onto a sky island which will be a cool thing to do because i think people will be more wanted that for quite a while now but i don't know who's wanted that but i've seen that some people are excited over on twitter so i guess that people wanted it but it's we're not, not so sure yet right now it's not confirmed but it would be cool and next thing is this chapter 4 season 2 will feature veils that you can grind on top of similar to the veil grinding system in games like sunset overdrive you'll get a speed boost while grinding on veils when it actually just goes down you get a little guy team and jumping off the veils it's basically like a new mobility item that i'm guessing and here are some recordings for anyone that is interested and also next season Next season, CRZ8, New One Links, and P3G LOI are NPCs. Now, I know some people might be thinking that why am I saying that? Well, these three P, these three skins were actually in a bundle i'm pretty sure according to what i've heard so if it is in a bundle i'll put on screen right now hopefully i am correcting this if i'm not i'm sorry but apparently they were in a bundle and the bundle has a chance to come back in the item shop so for anyone that's actually interested in getting things like links or pd pd then this is your chance to get them next season because even now things like the deep freeze operation bundle recently returned and that didn't come back for a while so the is a huge chance that these can return so that's why i mentioned it and next season we'll have another voice actor for the quest because obviously most likely next season will build up to a lot of events since we didn't get one this season part one will feature data receiver key i can't even say that key is peace and tampered tampered computer so yeah and next thing to talk about is epic has been working on special npcs being worked on heavy medic scout and supplies so my guess is heavy may be carrying maybe some weapons around medic may carry around some day some meds for you scout may scout the scout ahead for you and supply may just give you some supplies like wood materials and stuff like that and next now next season we are also getting a brand new star wars collaboration not just with lightsabers but also force powers so we'll get force lift force jump force lightning force pull force push force rip force script force vacuum now i don't understand why they not didn't not just do this for chapter 3 season 3 it would have been way better with the dark vader but hey never too late and also dark vader will return on the island a new male skin is also being worked on it will be called the code name for it is plot twist now i'm not entirely sure i'm pretty sure it is another code name or something that i'm trying to find I don't know if I'll be able to find it. Uh, no, I can't find the code in. Anyways, alright. Next up is talking more about this neon city. This will feature the following color scheme: aqua, deep blue, pink, blast, red, and sea foam. So really futuristic. Next season, we will also get a new version of the pump shotgun. So, anyone that misses the OG pump, long on to chapter 4 season 2 because we don't know if they're going to change it now. I doubt that it will be a one shot because, to be honest, because things like Zero Build are here now, if you have a gun that's one shot, Zero Build players are going to complain unless they change it both for build and Zero Build. And we're also going to get a new version of the Ranger Assault Rifle. And the season's code name is Radical, just for anyone that's interested. 
and next thing we need to talk about is obviously the weapons that i talked about earlier the weapons are going to be a smart pistol that tracks onto enemies we're also going to get a rope and chains grenade launcher which was mentioned earlier that we can scrap the exotic so yeah that one's confirmed basically so what's left to talk about there's also some new augments but i couldn't find the list i couldn't if i do find the list i'll put it on screen right now but there are a lot of them there's like 15 of them currently in the files or something so yeah if that's in the game then i'll put it on screen if it's not then yep sorry about that guys so and the final thing to basically talk about is from red leaks it is and that is Creative 2.0 has been renamed from Fortnite Valkyrie Game Client to UFUEFN, which means in other words, and also the recently Tim Sweeney re re retweeted the Happy UFEN releasement. So, in other words, it's basically confirmed that Creative 2.0 will come out this month. It will. So, and so anyone that's finally excited to get into new maps and make new stuff. Fortnite is about to change forever and also this means that support to create a code that might reopen it might it's not it's not confirmed but it might have a chance to reopen but you know what guys that is everything you need to know about chapter 4 season 2 from the battle pass to what to expect for the POIs anyways everyone thank you for sticking around if you have if you are here then make sure to please leave a like and also subscribe and a huge credit to all these leakers that are on screen right now for leaking this season so if i missed any leakers i apologize i apologize for that and also i want you to subscribe hit the notification bell so you don't miss any videos from me and if you want to watch my reactions to chapter 4 season 2 battle pass whenever that video comes out then click this video right here i promise that you will enjoy it and i'll see you lot over there see you in that video guys